While suicide prevention day is really important, I think, unfortunately, suicide remains the leading cause of death amongst young people in Australia. And this is despite multiple government inquiries and reviews. And in fact, in some sections of the population, suicide rates are actually increasing, particularly amongst young females. So we really need this to be on the national agenda. I think, unfortunately, we only often get reminded of the problem of suicide when, when a young person's very tragically taken their own lives. And this allows us to have the conversation in a more proactive and meaningful way. I think what we really need in Australia is some national leadership on this issue. Australia's suicide prevention strategy is well out of date and we really need the government to show some leadership in developing a strategic and coordinated approach to suicide prevention across the country. I think the other thing we really need to do is to destigmatize suicide so that when young people feel vulnerable they're actually able to talk about it and seek help. Here at Origin we're running a whole series of projects at the moment looking at the different ways that social media can be used for suicide prevention. And in fact, all of our social media World Suicide Prevention Day products have been developed by the young people that we're working with. So what we found is that young people and professionals tend to use social media very differently. Young people tend to use it to engage with other young people and to give and receive peer-to-peer -peer support, whereas professional organisations tend to use it for awareness raising and marketing purposes. So there's a real disconnect in terms of the way that we're engaging with these platforms. That's not to say that we shouldn't do this with caution. We absolutely should. But what we have been able to demonstrate in the work that we've been doing is that there are safe ways to engage with young people through social media. And there are ways that you can help upskill young people to be able to talk safely about suicide online. And they're really important skills for those young people to have. I think the take home message is if you feel suicidal, don't be afraid to talk about it and ask for help. And if you're worried about somebody who you think might be suicidal, don't be afraid to ask them if they're okay. Today's also Are You Okay Day? So make this the day you ask somebody if they are okay, and if they say no, then be ready to help.